Hello everyone, welcome back to the new episode of my tutorial series on software development. In the previous episode, we have successfully designed our form for our uh, dealer and customer module. In this episode, we will create business logic layer for our dealer and customer module in our billing and inventory management system. So without further delay, let's move to our tutorial series. <laughs> So first of all, we'll need to open our project by going to our project folder that is any store for me and opening our solution file that is any store dot solution and our project will be opened on Visual Studio IDE. So this is our form for dealer and customer module. Now we need to create business logic layer for this module. So let's go to the solution explorer and let's minimize ui folder and go to bll business logic layer and in bll folder right click on bll folder and click on add a new item and select class and give the name it will be d-e-a-c-u-s-t bll so press enter or click on add to create a new business logic layer class so here we will be creating getter and setter for our dealer and customer module before we create let's uh, confirm our uh, getter and setter properties by going to server explorer and we'll expand our database my database is any store so i'll expand it and expand tables and expand tbld underscore cost so we have id which is integer data type type backer name backer email backer contact varchar, address varchar, edit date, date time and edit by so we'll start with id so i'll type the shortcut which is prop tap tap and first one is integer so it will be integer and tap in id and enter and enter and second one is prop tap tap it is name so it will be string data type press enter tab and it will be type and enter enter prop tap tap is string and it will be name enter enter prop tap tap is string is string it will be email email then enter enter prop tap tap is string it will be contact contact and again another is prop tap tap a string it will be address enter enter and prop tap tap it will be date time and it is add it added underscore date and last one is prop tap tap integer and it is added underscore by so that's it so let's check out how many properties do we have we have one two three four five six seven and eight let's check out one two three four five six seven eight so this is it guys we have successfully created business logic layer class uh, for our dealer and customer module uh, if you like this video then don't forget to like uh, share and subscribe if you want to see more videos like this uh, and if you have any confusion related to this video then don't forget to comment or reply as soon as possible and in the next video we will create data access layer for our dealer and customer module where we will create uh, methods to add update delete and select in our database so till then see you soon bye bye